Good Do you struggle with having enough energy to get to the gym? Or maybe just to get through your day. Maybe you're not even going to the gym, but you're thinking you want to, but your thought process is, I'm so tired. Like I have a physically demanding job or my kids wear me out or like whatever it is. We, we all get tired. We all struggle with certain things. And one thing that we often overlook when it comes to working out is we think of the sacrifice. Oh, I'm going to be even more tired or I have to get up earlier or stay up later in order to get a workout in and I'm already exhausted and I'm just going to be more exhausted. Here's the thing. When you start working out and you start exercising regularly, you get more energy. Once you get into a routine with it and have been at it for a few weeks, you're going to find that you're not as tired as much, even if you are getting less sleep because your body it thrives off exercise, it thrives off movement, it thrives off of you pushing yourself past what you thought your limits were. And so it's this weird reverse cycle thing because again, common sense will tell us, well, if I'm working harder, then I'm gonna be more tired, but it's not the case with this. And this comes even more into play when you start exercising and getting your nutrition right because nutrition affects not only our mental state and how clear we think but it affects our energy levels if we're just eating crap and greasy whatever all day long our bodies are working so hard to digest that and on top of that we're not able to perform at our peak performance because the body is not getting what it needs so when you align these two things together, both nutrition and exercising, and they meet together, you're going to find that you're going to feel like a new person. And yes, you may be sore for the first couple of weeks and you may be missing your ice cream and your cookies for the first couple of weeks. Like I'm not saying it's all sunshine and rainbows. There's going to be tough stuff you have to go through. But once you get through that initial phase, you are going to feel so much better. If you don't believe me, try it. Like just get out there and do it. Stop overthinking it. Stop saying you can't or that you don't have the time or that you don't have the energy. You do make it happen. All right. So if you've enjoyed this video, please like or comment below as well as subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss any future videos.